Gary, congratulations on your induction. Oh, thank you. I have a few questions I want to ask you. Okay. About your life. Thank you. What individuals had the greatest influence on you and your wrestling career? I would have to say my high school coach, Jack Fernandez of Maricosa High School. Who is or was your idol? Um, having a chance to work the 1984 Olympic Games and being from California, I'm, I would have to say uh, David Schultz. How did you get started in wrestling? Well, it's, it's kind of funny uh, story, but uh, the Japanese national team came to uh, Maricosta High School to wrestle, and one of our uh, wrestling gods, Ron Gilbert, had tied the Japanese national champion, and I just saw what the crowd did, and it was so exciting, and I decided to join up for the team the next year. Wow. What do you attribute your success in wrestling to? Uh, I would have to contribute to hard work. Is there one outstanding situation or memory that you have involving wrestling? Well, I had the opportunity, uh, Ken Boss, who was a wrestler at Cal Poly and went to Rio Hondo College. Um, and when I got the job down at Santa Ana College, he called me to, uh, to work the 1984 Olympic Games. That was probably the most, the highlight of my uh, coaching career. Is there a wrestler, as, as a wrestler, is there one match that really stands out in your mind? Well, um, I would have to go back when I was in high school. Um, we had a chance to go back to Japan and I had the opportunity to beat, uh, be the California State Champion. I beat uh, uh, a wrestler by Mike, Mike Colego who eventually became an NCAA champion. So that was pretty outstanding for me to, uh, to win that trip to go to Japan. How did you decide to, or why did you decide to become a wrestling coach? Well, it's kind of a, um, um, I think the aerospace business, um, I had to go back to work professionally. Um, I had two knee operations and I had to stop competing as a wrestler and uh, when the aerospace business crashed um, and I was laid off, my high school coach called me and uh, uh, Jack Fernandez asked me to be his assistant coach and um, it's history since then. I mean I've been involved for 35 years so after that. If you could start all over again what would you do differently as a coach? Well, um, as a coach, I, I think I had a great path. Um, um, I had great mentors. I, I would have to say uh, um, I'm very happy with how my career went. I had uh, Jack Fernandez, who's in the Hall of Fame. I had Dave Hank Steller, who's in the Hall of Fame. And I work with Kent Wyatt, who's in the Hall of Fame. And I was recruited by Vaughn Hitchcock out of high school to uh, go to Cal Poly, but uh, something I really regret not doing. But uh, um, I just had a chance to uh, meet some wonderful people with the sport of wrestling. What would you like people to remember you, about you? Um, I, I hope my wrestlers will remember me for giving them life skills. How, how did wrestling contribute to your life? Well, um, wrestling had been a, has been a big part of my life. I had a chance to travel to Japan twice, once as a wrestler, once as a team leader. Had a chance to go to Egypt as a team leader. Uh, went to uh, New Zealand as a team leader. And, um, you know, it's provided a living for my family. And, you know, I have no regrets uh, being a high school coach. And it's, uh, it's been my livelihood for, for most of my life. Well, Gary, congratulations and thank you. Oh, thank you very much.